Okay. So, dear students, today I am going to discuss about reflection. In this process of reflection, first thing we need is one mirror. If you consider a mirror, from here, for example, I am going to consider any torch. So from the torch, light ray comes, it falls on the mirror, it gets reflected back. There is one line which is imagined at this place, which is drawn here, that is called as normal. And this normal is a light ray, which is making 90 degrees with the mirror. So what are the things we are considering in this? One is incident ray, which is falling on the mirror. Another is reflected ray. So the angle made by the incident ray with the normal is called as angle of incidence. The angle made by the reflected with the normal is called as angle of reflection. And this is called as glancing angle. That is called as angle of glance. On either sides, angle of glancing is considered. Okay. So first thing is, what are the laws of reflection? What are the laws of reflection? The first law is, the angle made by the incident ray with the normal is also is equal to angle made by the reflect ray ray with the normal. Both angles are going to be same. So both angles are going to be same. Okay, angle of incidence, angle of reflection, both are going to be same. What is the second law? Second law is incident ray normal and reflected ray lie on same plane okay so incident ray normal reflected ray are going to lie on the same plane okay what is the third one third one when light ray suffers reflection then there is a phase change of 180 degrees or it can also be called as pi. So whenever the light suffers reflection, there is a phase change of 180 degrees or it is also called as pi. So now the fourth point is whenever light uh, falls on a mirror and reflects back, the fourth point is frequency Wavelength remains same. Frequency wavelength remains same, but there is one thing which is going to change. What is that? But intensity intensity decreases. Intensity is going to change. That is going to decrease here. Wavelength remains same. Frequency remains same. But intensity is going to decrease. That is the change here. So this is about the reflection. And here, angle of glancing, angle of glancing, these two angles are same. And angle of incidence, angle of incidence plus angle of glancing at this side will be equal to angle of reflection plus angle of glancing on that side and these two sum of angle of incidence plus glancing angle of reflection plus glancing is, is, is going to be 90 degrees so they are making 90 degrees because it is going to be the normal as we have said already that as this is going to be the normal, the sum of these two is 90 and the sum of these two is also going to be 90. So this is called as process of reflection. So now, after this process of reflection, we shall go for the next topic.